Hey everyone, Golden Ninja 3000 here again. Today we've gotten a ton of summer set news for 2021, so in this video I'll be covering the superheroes news. Right off the bat, we do have official confirmation that Marvel will be getting a collectible minifigure series in August. This was confirmed by a Spanish site, so I'm going to take you guys over to that listing right now. This listing was found by FalconFan1414, and you can see we have the set number over here, 71031, and it says that it's part of the Disney Marvel collection. This site is in Spanish, you can translate it, it doesn't give us any more information than that, other than that the piece count is 10. Now for minifigure series, they just use the piece count of like the highest minifigure. So I'm really interested in this because I never thought that we would get a Marvel CMF series. This is like a dream come true for me, but I really hope it's not 12 figures like they're doing in 2021. I really hope that this is at the very least 16 because getting 12 minifigures would be a little bit disappointing. Also, I just don't know if it's going to be comic or MCU based. Like it says Disney Marvel. I feel like that would lean more towards the movies. Like I know Disney owns all of Marvel, but you know, I feel like you really think of Disney as a movie company or theme parks, but I don't know. I really hope it's MCU based, although I'm definitely not going to complain if it's comic based either, because I really want a comic book Scarlet Witch minifigure. As for the rest of the sets, these are just all superheroes, so we don't really know, you know, if they're for Marvel or DC, but we have 76189 with 49 pieces for $10, 76190 with 479 pieces for $40, 76191, 590 pieces, $70. 76192, 527 pieces for $70. 76193, 1,901 pieces for $150. And 76194, 369 pieces for $35. We do still have some sets that we haven't seen yet because there were a ton of set numbers released for the first half of the year, and we still haven't seen all of those. There's not much we can speculate on here since we don't even know what theme it's for. Personally, I'm really hoping that the $35 or $40 set is for WandaVision. You know, like, Falcon Fan has kind of said that we could see WandaVision sets. Like, it, it's pretty unknown right now. But given that Paul Bettany just said we will be seeing giant, like, final battles in the last three episodes, I'm really hoping that we get a set. And the $150 set is really interesting to me because with 1,900 pieces, that's an excellent price per part ratio. And like, no offense, but like a Marvel usually doesn't have such a good price per part ratio or DC for that matter. I don't know if that's a direct to, con to consumer set or not. I'm going to guess no. And if so, that's going to be really exciting because like that kind of reminds me of the original Arkham Asylum set from like 2013. So we'll have to see what that is, but I'm very excited about that. So that's it for today. I will be releasing more 2021 videos throughout the day, so check back for those. Bye for now.